hello and welcome to my youtube channel powerpoint university in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to create a multi-slide powerpoint presentation and this particular presentation is inspired from the powerpoint school and many of my viewers requested me to make a similar kind of uh, uh, slides so here it goes you can see here there are five different options and when i click the first option comes here and then all the animation whatever i did in my previous uh, videos i have just copied here and then when i click it will show you the second the third the fourth slide and the last one fifth and here i have used the morph transition and to use this you need to have at least uh, PowerPoint 2018 or Office 365 version. Go to Insert tab, Shapes, select a rectangle, cover the slide with the rectangle and shape outline, make it no outline and shape fill, you can give a light gray and I'm just going to cut this much area for that I'm going to insert shapes select an oval shape draw the oval shape something like this right mouse click go to format shape and increase the transparency level so that I know how much area I'm going to cut it so make it no outline zoom a little bit and make sure that it is properly aligning it the corner so this I have to reduce a little bit perfect it should be at the corners it should be perfect this is okay now I am going to cut only this area which you can see which is uh, the shaded area for that I'm going to select the rectangle and the oval shape under format go to merge shape and just say subtract so you can see here you end up with this shape I'm going to press ctrl D to add one more and I'm going to give a different color for this for example I'm going to give a light blue color and I'm going to send this back and only a small part only should be visible something like this and I'm going to add one small oval shape again go to insert shapes select a oval shape hold the shift key while you are making the uh, oval and align it perfectly in the center or you can go to align say middle so I'm just going to keep only this much area and the rest of them I'm going to delete that one for that I'm just going to make a duplicate object this one the same object and then select the oval shape and this shape go to merge shape and just say subtract so you can you end up with this only shape outline make it no outline and I'm going to give the same color and for this I'm going to give a shadow effect and you can zoom in further and just check whether it is perfectly aligned so I'm just going to make it move somewhere here and I'm just going to add a number there which is 0 1 center align use your favorite font I'll make it white color and put it exactly at the center which is 0 1 so one only one slide is ready so I have to just make a duplicate slide and give a different color to that and if you want you can add a, a maybe a 
shadow effect for this also and then I am just going to duplicate this slide right mouse click and say duplicate slide now this will be my slide number 2 and I am going to give some different colors now this one maybe I will give uh, orange and this also I am going to select the same orange then press ctrl D this will be my third slide again give a different color maybe I'm going to use this color and the same color press ctrl D so I'm going to make it five altogether so this will be my fourth use some nice colors maybe I'll just use this color and then this will be my last this is fifth and I'm going to give maybe a blue color so here I have created five different slides now I'm going to copy all this object into one slide so before copying to the first slide I'm just going to select one by one and press ctrl G to group it come to the second slide select all the objects and press ctrl G and then this will be my third select all objects press ctrl G for fourth and this will be fifth press ctrl G now I'm going to slide number two copy this and come to slide number one and paste it and just give a little gap where you can see the numbers then third slide copy this and paste it here then this fourth slide control C control V and then the last one copy this and paste it here so here you can see here I have copied all this in one slide now I'm just going to select the slide one which is selecting all the objects and move the other side so if I play it should look like this something like this okay or if you want you can make you can move a little bit further now let's see here so this area is sufficient for us so I've got one two three four five now I'm just going to duplicate this slide right mouse click and just say duplicate the slide and just move the first option to the right side then press ctrl D again or right mouse click duplicate slide select the second option move here to the right again ctrl D duplicate select the third option again ctrl D duplicate I'm going to select the fourth option and then one more time duplicate slide and move the fifth also all right now I'm going to set the slide number two to slide number say six go to transition and say morph transition 
and remember this MOV transition is available only 2018 and uh, Office 365 versions and uh, older version like 2007, 2010 this option does not exist. So if you want to use this slide you have to use either Office uh, 365 or PowerPoint 2018 version. So I am selecting the MOV transition you can see here. Now if I go and play this one, the first comes, then the second, the third, fourth and the fifth. Now what we can do here is we can add each a different set of animations or set of different designs you can add it here. Here I'm going to copy my own existing uh, designs. For example, I want to copy this uh, this tree diagram, which is a green energy. I'm just going to select all, Control A and Control C, copy, and come to our presentation, and right mouse click, and paste it here. You need to adjust a little bit here and there. All right. Now again, if I click, it will show you something like this. Then again, the second one. For second one, I'm just going to select maybe this tree diagram. I'm going to select all. accept this control C come here and paste control V all right likewise you can add it again so let me just show you from the beginning if I click it will show you one then this will come then all the animation will come here then it will take you to the third slide again third slide for example I just want to copy this one control A control C and I'm just copying it here and if you want you can group it and reduce the size also or you can copy as image as well. So this is my third slide. So likewise you can add all the remaining slides here and all the unwanted slides you can simply delete this one. So I don't need this one so I'm just going to delete this one. So let's see how it looks in the presentation uh, in the slideshow. So here you can see in the slideshow it will show you the one, two, three, four and five options. So when I click, it will show you the first option and then when I click, it will show you the second option with the animation and when I click, it will show you the third option. So fourth and fifth have not added anything, so it will show you something like this. So that's it from me friends, hope you like this tutorial. And don't forget to subscribe and share my channel PowerPoint University. That's it from me friends. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel and don't forget to subscribe PowerPoint University. See you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.